The basement of the Cincinnati Museum Center is the temporary host of one of America's greatest achievements, an achievement that people like Gene still remember 50 years later. When they landed on the moon, I was working at the Hamilton Journal News. Me and my wife got up about 3 o'clock in the morning to watch it because we nobody believed we could do it, and it was really the biggest thing in my lifetime that the America has ever accomplished. The Cincinnati Museum Center is one of the few museums to host America's greatest Cold War achievement. Hello, I'm Dave Dzinski, Vice President of Featured Experiences here at Cincinnati Museum Center, and we're in our special exhibit gallery right now where we're hosting a very special exhibit from the Smithsonian Institution called Destination Moon. We're one of only five venues across the country that gets to host this uh, spectacular exhibit with Apollo 11 artifacts in it. Uh, we're the fifth and final venue before these artifacts go back to the Smithsonian for permanent installation there in the Air and Space Museum. So you'll see behind us is the Apollo 11 command module. This is the module that took the astronauts to the moon, Neil Armstrong, Buzz Aldrin, and uh, Collins. And uh, this capsule circled the moon. It did not go down to the surface of the moon, but it circled the moon and then brought all three astronauts back and splashed down in the ocean. So this is the only surviving piece of the huge Saturn V rocket. Along with the module being displayed, you can also see Buzz Aldrin's visor and glove. The battle to put a man on the moon against Russia highlights America at her best. Come see Destination Moon, Apollo 11, from now until February 17th. Corey Foister, Cincy Spotlight.